Okay, so now, continuing with the sequence. Enter on the double, switch my swing single, go to my tight waist, step and drag, uh, inside foot uh, sweep. So here we are. Boom, boom, boom. Off the retraction, high hand snuffle. He gets his lunge position. I run to my single right here. I step and slide. Still keeping that good pressure shoulder. Now step and drag. When I step and drag, look where his foot is away from the cage. If his foot's next to the cage, bring it back. There's no way I can do anything with his foot there. Bring his both feet back. Well, when I get to this good position on my tight weights with a 10 finger grip, step and slide, boom. Now it's left foot in. Because I need to bring my left foot in so this leg becomes light. When I'm driving right now, this is heavy. This is heavy as well. But the closer I bring it in, now this is light, which allows me to look at that hand there. Watch when I drop to my knee. Look where my weight is sitting on this hip here. That's that hand there. Watch when I drive forward. Now I can catch. And now I really can't reach, but if I keep driving, my hand lands in that perfect position again. Walk my hips, straighten them along the cage. Always driving in and forward. So now it makes it nearly impossible for him to like get out of this position. But again, they're gonna bump and buck. But when I keep a strong leg here, this leg allows me to do so much. I can drive here, I can drive here, I can switch a little bit, I can turn my hips down and drive even heavier and land heavier shots. Any of the referees gonna stop that fight? One more time. Boom. Eventually, we're going to give you the finish just by trying to get out. There's not going to be an intelligent way to get out from that position until you see the second DVD. Uh, but until then, right now, it's just going to be you're going to have some real good success with these different positions.